today this is not a spring chicken. As you notice, we have a little bit different scenery today. We're looking at the fountain. We just happen to be over at the National Products Expo West, and we've been here all day, so, well, we kind of know what news is going on, don't we? Yeah, we know what news is going on uh, five hours ago. I know, and I'm here with Old Camp with comments and the headlines of today, and the terror indictment unveiled for Norway massacre. It means that uh, they can charge him with anything you want to charge him with, and he'll be released from jail in a few years because Norway does not have the death penalty and they do not have locking people up for life. And early Ohio returns caused prediction market swings. Well, yeah, because that was sort of ridiculous. I mean, what happened was is they were certain that Romney was going to win by a, a huge amount and Romney barely won in Ohio. So it changed everything on the market the next day. And suspicion rises between Western advisors and Afghans. Well, yeah, because the Western advisors don't trust the Afghans now. Is that what it is? Well, because the Afghans are killing the Western advisors. And liberal congressman Dennis Kucinich defeated in Ohio. Yeah, he defeated by a woman that's about 10 years older than he was, which is ridiculous. They said it's going to be an easy win over Joe the, the bomber. I don't think so because Ohio is swinging Republicans because they got massive unemployment. And still winless, Ron Paul campaign presses on. Because he's picking up delegates. The, the whole thing is, I mean, years ago I worked on a movie that uh, uh, Robert Wagner was in, and they told, Robert Wagner was actually playing a, you know, he was playing a guy that he was doing in real life, which is he was running the race circuit, and they told him, don't go out to win, just go to finish, and you're going to, you're going to do well. That's what Ron Paul is doing, he's going to finish. And he will finish with enough delegates to swing the election and to swing a platform. And when he swings the platform, they all said he's going to he's going to then give his support to uh, Johnson, who is an independent. In five, Mitt Romney relatives endorsed Ron Paul. I know that's never a good sign. It's that that the, the Romney campaign is in serious trouble everywhere because they're they're reevaluating the fact that he can't put anybody out of the way. And in fact, it's not a He's going to lose the entire South, except for Virginia, of which he only was running by himself and almost lost. That's a good one. And how, how do you almost lose an election? You're the only man on the ballot. I know. Isn't that bad? Yeah. Yeah. One dead in Ohio nursing home meth lab fire. Isn't that nice? Running a meth lab out of a nursing home. <laughs> yeah. Well, they probably could use it, right? Yeah. And thieves robbed the Girl Scouts of $200 and the Scouts fight back. Oh yeah, well these were not little girl scouts, these were the older teenage girls. Oh they scouts. were? Yeah. You were teenagers to the girl scouts? Yeah, but yeah, just like boy scouts. Oh. Remember there's the brownies and then there's girl scouts. Girl oh, scouts that's right. Ones. Okay, yeah. tour bus ignites near Nevada's Hoover Dam. Ooh. Oh, I know, that's never good because there's really, uh, it's, it's, yeah, Hoover Dam is, is far away from where emergency services are. So. And where are the mini mids? Well, because uh, his, his kid basically don't want anything to do with him. So, you know, he had, now he's basically making a fool out of himself and spending money like a quarter. And young North Carolina children survived direct twister strike. Yeah, well, because I've seen it, I've, I've, I've seen it where uh, a whole building can be thrown off the ground and a guy standing with no protection whatsoever will be totally passed by by a tornado. Oh, really? Yep. And Maryland teen plans guilty plea in terror case in Pennsylvania. Yeah, well, because that way he gets off the hook. And Venezuela to ship more fuel to Syria as crackdown spreads. Yeah, because, I mean, if, um, if he, if the guy who, the, he who controls the, from Damascus controls Syria, and as long as uh, Assad controls Damascus, it's going to stand out. And Jessica Simpson mirrors Demi Moore by appearing in a bold manner on a magazine. Well, I know it because they said, I mean, I mean, I, I was listening to people last night. Once again, why in the world do women that don't want to be naked all of a sudden want to be naked when they're having a kid? I mean, that makes no sense to anybody. I know, and it wasn't even what was it vanity? It wasn't even Vanity Fair. No, it was like Gentleman's Court or something. I don't know, but uh, GQ. But they, it was the one that Demi Moore was in, except Demi Moore wasn't quite that heavy. I mean, Dem they said Jessica Simpson is really heavy. Mm. And Limbaugh says everything's cool, even as 40 plus advertisers flee. Because he's got, he had three or four times that amount waiting to advertise on his show. <laughs> plus, they said everybody that left his show is suffering stock wise now. 
Oh, really? They said this is what happens when, well, okay, what it is, they bow to social media pressure and quit, and then all of a sudden they find out that the people that were actually buying their product are unhappy with them. Oh, you mean because they pulled their advertising? Well, because they're uh, because they they don't like you bowing to somebody else. Because remember, most of the people that advertise with Limbaugh and those people are right wing supporters. So when you tell your people to get lost, plus now they're finding out that it was a bloody setup. It seems like the woman is working for uh, uh, with Anita Dunn, who is uh, is what used to be the communications director for Obama, and she works for. Her. Oh, really? Yeah. That's a total setup then. Yeah. Yeah, the Daily Show's, yeah, they're setting up Li Rush Limbaugh. Well, no, Rush Limbaugh, okay. Rush Limbaugh is playing Glenn Beck's bad cop to the mm -hmm. good cop now. He gets some, uh, what happens is Limbaugh's ratings were starting to go down, and he needed to jump the ratings up, so what he did was they probably made a deal with the Obama campaign, and they, they fed him somebody. They basically, the Obama people fed somebody to the lion. And she didn't realize this was going to happen because now there's a massive investigation going on on her. And yeah, on that three thousand dollars needed per month for birth control or whatever it was. Three thousand dollars for her birth birth control for a year. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and the Daily Show's John Stewart takes on Iran war drums. Well, they're going to lose that battle on the left because the left is wanting to. The left needs the Jewish money, and if you allow. If you, I mean, what's going to happen, Israel's going to attack no matter what Obama wants. And when it happens, Obama, they're expecting that our country will probably, okay, here's what they said, they will give the United States no indication of when they're going to do it because they're afraid Obama will leak the information to the Muslims. Really? So you can't trust Obama, that's what they said, they cannot trust him. And Texas man executed for a boyfriend. Yeah, yeah and it, it used to be legal in Texas, it didn't anymore. Oh, it was legal? Yeah, basically it's the same thing in France. If uh, you, if the wife catches the husband fooling around and kills the husband, it's murder. If the husband finds the wife fooling around and kills the wife and her boyfriend, it's, it's justifiable homicide. Uh, and too many foreigners in France, Sarkozy says. I know, and because the place is still full of Muslims, they're basically, uh, they're trying to, they're basically the Muslims are wanting Sharia law in a state that's got Christian laws and it is not going well. Remember, Notre Dame Cathedral is in France. Ah, yes. And deputy and two others shot outside Oklahoma courthouse. I know. I mean, I don't know. I never could understand why. My father's a police officer. I could never understand why they would pick on basically people at courthouses because those guys don't do anything. They're just paid clerks is all they are. And Florida honors student win as a retreat from deportation. I know what the, uh, okay. The problem was is that, you know, if you're here illegally, you're here illegally. You're never supposed to be in a school to begin with. And Virginia governor signs pre-abortion ultrasound bill. Which has basically already been thrown out by the court because of the fact that it's illegal. But you have to tell people that, you know, you must, re you require an uh, ultrasound of all people, of all women, so that the women can see that there's a child there. That's just illegal. They lost their ground. I mean, it, the court basically stayed that one about 10 seconds after the bill was passed. And Pentagon chief said the U.S. should not act alone in Syria. Oh, I love that. They said the United States should get permission of the United Nations before it acts uh, militarily anymore, which basically, they said Obama is going to have to back off of that one because the Republicans have been pounding away that the Democrats want to turn the control of our military over to the UN. So what did Panetta say? That we, we're, he wants to turn the control of our military over to the UN. He said that will be, that's a no win win for Obama again. That's a no one, yeah, that's a total no win. An Australian admits fake collar bomb extortion bid. Well, yeah, that's how they, they rob banks and stuff anymore. They, they act like they're being threatened with clothes and then go rob the bank. Oh, that's what they do? They, they, it's actually a change. They basically for people watching movies. And the U.S. defense targeting Americans in war on terror. Well, it's also against the law, but it, they said it's getting it, but Obama doesn't tend to pay any attention to what our laws are, so. And the tour, um, one dead in Ohio, no, what, two. Yeah. Maryland team plans guilty plea in terror case in Pennsylvania. I know. Basically, uh, you know, you know, because that he, he figured that by, by getting a plea bargain, he basically gets let loose. So, 
And a Monty Bubble is from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. I know. Too many forget how they got to where they are. 